let's talk about how my drill broke. <laughs> Guys, I look like pure crap today, and it always happens. So, if you didn't notice, I changed my nails up. Uh, today, I'm gonna have to try and record as quickly as possible. I usually don't like to rush my recordings. But yeah, um, my tripod was acting up. I had to uns- the screw kind of was getting loose so the tripod was wiggly and one of the legs came off so I screwed that back together my drill while I was doing my nails yesterday broke I'm having bad luck these few days uh, I'm wearing this shirt because this is the only shirt that I feel generally looks okay I might wear it today for uh, the birthday that I'm going to be celebrating um, but I decided to do, like, very dark makeup. It's quick. I'm doing a quick look today. Um, I generally want to use old palettes that I barely use today. So I'm going to look for it. I found a palette that I thought was fitting to do. Use. I might use this one because of the purple and the black. Um, uh, I might need to use this with it, uh which is not an old well it's an old palette but i use it a lot already um but we're gonna use it we're gonna do the eyeshadow first i'm gonna definitely wipe off the eyeshadow after this but not the face makeup so we're good with that if i keep on looking down that way in all my videos it's i'm taking out makeup because girl when you do makeup you need to take off like the eyeshadows and stuff all uh, of things I, I have a mirror here why do I keep on looking down or up jeez but um if I in my videos I look down because I have a this is my makeup drawer my vanity and I have my makeup in the drawers this side and this side is other stuff and then in the middle is where I have my skincare and eyeshadows uh, and stuff the back drawers just have like uh, my K-pop merch. Um, so if you want to rob me, I'm not the best one to rob, to be honest. I barely have any K-pop merch. Well, to all the TikTokers who have way more K-pop merch than me, uh, I only have one drawer of K-pop merch, so I think that's not as fitting. No. I'm gonna use Dream State. I, also, I don't think you can even buy this anymore, because uh, I got that from what was it uh hush and i think hush went out of business because of how cheap the products were or whatever um and the free shipping and all that stuff um but i don't know they were pring people at one point um but yeah i'm just using dream state if you can find these please tell me because i kind of want to buy more bad habit products but I used to buy a lot from Hush. Hush was really like one of the low key places I would buy makeup from. Um, it kind of felt like Shein and Romway, but for makeup. Uh, I kind of want to use Immortal now. I barely use black eyeshadows and stuff because I feel like, I don't know, I can't do uh, smoky eyes, but today we're going to try our best. Ooh. The patchiness is not helping me today, so I'm going to go back here. Some shades aren't as patchy as others, but I'm going to go into uh, my favorite. This is my favorite um, ColourPop uh, eyeshadow. They changed the name um, for some reason, but I don't know why they discontinued it and changed the name. I talked about that before, I think. I don't remember. I'm not showing that, so, should I, okay, back to talking about my room, because <laughs> I think, why am I going to this one, if I'm going, if this is the black I want, I don't, I don't know what I'm doing, anyways, uh, my room is, like, it's weird, here has, like, my K-pop merch, uh, here is, like, my hair stuff, uh, nail stuff, then K-pop merch, then shipping stuff? Oh, and then also my accessories and stuff, like, but yeah, my room is weird. And then on the top, I have, like, 
uh, my contact stuff and then other stuff like hair stuff perfumes and stuff and then I also usually have a baby here which you can't see so I don't know why I I like the baby there though so you're keeping that but um yeah that's what I was talking about and then I started talking about um makeup products was it makeup I don't remember uh oh no this I brought this to switch out the products I use but I don't know if it really works so we'll see I'm going into sleep though um but yeah so today we're going to be rushing uh, hopefully it comes out good. I don't... Why am I going so dark? Um, I don't usually go and, like, do smoky eyes, so that's another thing. Uh, I'm just trying a new look, because I always tend to go lighter, not darker. So if this looks horrible, just know. Um, but this is more of a get ready with me. I, I didn't mention that. Hmm. Uh, but this is more of a get ready with me, so... Yeah. Um, but if you have cheap, like, websites that I can buy, um, makeup from, please send. Because I used to really like, uh, Hush. The products weren't, like, amazing, but some of them were. I'm going to be using this. Um, this is old, so I don't think I should be putting it on my eyes, but I'm putting it on my eyes anyway. I should start, like, going more into, like, the products I used to use like use older products or I should like try and like recreate a look that someone else did watching a video today's more of a get ready with me even though I'm not actually like going to wear this uh like the eyeshadow I just wanted to do something dark because I've been feeling very dark lately mental health wise and then just like fashion wise I've been really wanting to do alternative looks lately so that's how we've been feeling to say a quick thing lately i've been very into playing the sims 4 i don't know why i just have and like it's probably because of all the mods that i've been downloading all the newer mods and i don't know uh at this point like i stopped playing sims 4 because i didn't have the money to buy any new expansion packs, all the new expansion packs weren't really my favorite. Also, my eyes like burning right here. I don't know why. I wiped off makeup. Is it because of that? I don't know. My skin has been very sensitive, and I've been <sighs> even if my makeup looks horrible, we're keeping it because I'm not doing. I'm not changing my face. Okay, I'm changing. I don't have the time to be changing <sighs> lately. I've been changing my makeup a lot, and it's not fun for me, but yeah, I've been playing Sims 4 a lot, and I've been going into my old household and just clean, like, redoing all the CC, because there's been households I haven't played for two years, two years, and it's surprising because I used to play them like crazy, it's just I haven't been really playing Sims 4 lately. And it's it's good to go back and like actually genuinely play it for yourself instead of playing it because you're doing videos for it. Um, I don't try to play in my own household because I really don't genuinely like playing in my own household. I mean like um like sim self household. Um, but I play others households. Today is really not a makeup day. Lately, I haven't been having makeup days, but hopefully this pulls through. Have you been struggling this week? I know I'm going to be struggling a lot. Nail drill. So, I was doing my nails yesterday. Um, you already can see by how they're changed. Um, they look bad. Uh the black didn't pull through I don't know I just everything I've been doing hasn't been best um the fill was perfect until I was trying to uh fix my cuticles a little bit more just to help with the fill and uh my drill just I was trying to pull the um 
drill bit out so I can put it away and it wasn't coming out it was stuck and so I tried to use like a plier or a cuticle cutter um, and the drill just the drill bit just with the force just uh, split into two inside the drill bit so um, because it's not like the other drill bits where you just turn it and pull it out you actually have to yank it out which I don't think it's a good thing because whenever you try and like put um, your drill like bit pull your drill bit out it can get stuck because some of them just like it just doesn't work that way so because the tinier ones like the thinner ones um, sometimes don't have a thing to help it manage to pull out I don't know what I'm talking about I'll probably put a diagram I don't know how my editing will be in this video but yeah so it wasn't it's it wasn't my greatest moment my greatest achievement so um, we're gonna act like that didn't happen I brought a new one it's supposed to come today so let's hope for the best I also brought this so I decided to get a uh, face one there's still some water in there uh, a body one because a lot of people use big ones right I wanted to know um, if it would work for me because I do have a really long and big face which probably will take me a few seconds to get done and I pretty much did okay this is gonna be a mold that's what I do with my pimples that I can't explain um, I turned them into molds but this is honestly I really like this it's wet still but um it's damp enough that it actually works this feels like a cooling massage I don't know it feels nice this. I brought this when I went to Target with my aunt because my aunt wanted to check the TVs um and yeah I brought this while I was at Target I also brought like a cuticle uh, oil because I don't have cuticle oils which you should get when you do your nails because it helps hydrate your cuticles again um cuticles are important that's what protects your nails from from any harmful bacteria so you should take care of it after you mistreated it so much right um but yeah i brought cuticle oil and it works but um it's actually really good so i don't mind that cuticle oil i look pasty and oil and um ghostly on camera but in real life it's not this bad um it's just in camera it looks very ghostly um it's probably because of the new beauty blender that i purchased um it's not a beauty blender it's a beauty sponge sorry beauty blender i don't want to get on your bed i already used this as a foundation so i don't think i should use it as a concealer um it's an actual concealer um and that's like my winter shade um it's summer but because the current situation with the world we're in a global you know um i think we should uh, understand that i don't go outside as often so it shouldn't matter how pasty i look because um i'm pale like this also when i put on the uh powder like the translucent powder it darkens this up a bit so it shouldn't matter how light and pasty it is, it's going to look very dark, like two seconds. Um, so that's my face right now. I'll try and fix the eyeshadow thing. I might just end up using Immortal um, and just filling the in-between because that's what is making it feel like it's ugly, to be honest. I'm going to add a little bit more purple on the lid. Maybe using a different brush. I'll use this padding brush. Um, so I'm going to put a little bit of Destiny again in the middle. Like on the lid, trying to pack it up. And then I'm going to go in with a uh, full metal alchemist. And go in the m straight middle of this. And just like really, really 
make it pop in the middle. Okay, that is looking way better than what we had before. So I'm going to take this brush and go into uh, Starstruck, which is one of my favorite colors ever. I've always said that if I ever um, pick a palette, I'll just have this color, like something like that. Because, girl, that color is so pretty for the inner corner. It does so much. I don't know what I'm going to do to my eyebrows. I might just do, like, really brush it high up. This issue is honestly what's annoying me, though. This. That. Okay, I'm going to spritz it. To rehydrate that part and then maybe because if I put powder it's not gonna work can't notice this area here there's no foundation on it at all but I'll cover this with um, liner so I can't really like I have to rush and I feel like this rush makeup look is what's making it look bad but you know you have time <gasps> and we're done that is basically what we're doing um i hope you enjoy this disaster of a video this is the end of the makeup look um i had a lot of trial like errors instead of trials so uh i'll see you next week um this makeup look does not represent me if this is your first uh video of me doing makeup um we have better things than this um this was a real mistake i'm still gonna upload it so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video um we didn't pull through um but yeah see you in the next one love you